Good evening. Welcome to the second annual percussion concert. My name is Anna Sims and I'm in sixth grade. Please take a moment to silence all electronic devices. Thank you in advance for your patience as we reset the stage between pieces as quickly as possible. The first performance tonight is Metric Lips. Metric Lips was originally written and recorded by Bella Fleck. This piece will be performed by the upper school students, Nick Fan, Susanna Kaiser, Sam Knight, and Tim Liu. They learn this piece completely on their own before and after school. Please welcome them to the stage.
Hi, my name is Jack Anderson and I am in ninth grade. The next piece is For Fun, For Drum. This piece requires rhythm rhythmic independence, dynamic control, and good timing from all the players. Please help me in welcoming the fifth grade percussionist. Hi, my name is Sam Knight and I'm in 10th grade. The next performance is from the middle school percussionist. They'll be performing Raindrops, the first movement of a three movement work entitled Rainbows. This mallet ensemble is written in the minimalistic style. You'll hear repetition similar to a rainstorm with growing intensity as additional players are added. This piece starts and ends with a solo marimba part performed by Kian Yusenazna. Please welcome the middle school percussionist.
Good evening. My name is Matthew Norris, and I am in the ninth grade. Next on the program is movement number three from animals. This movement represents a few of the larger animals. The lion is represented by the snare drum, the tiger is represented by the xylophone, and the hippo is represented by the bass drum, and lastly, the elephant is represented by the timpani. Please welcome back the sixth grade percussionist. Hi, my name is Tim Liu, and I am in 10th grade. From the same work, next is Movement 2 from Animals. This movement represents some of the medium-sized animals. The hyena, represented by the snare drum, the cheetah, by the bongos, the monkey, by the congas, and the kangaroo, by the concert toms. Please welcome back the middle school percussionist.
Hello, my name is Sloane Sabrixky, and I am in fifth grade. The next piece is suite number one. The piece makes use of a rhythmic motif in 4-4 four, four time that is later explored in 7-8 time. This work is high energy with a lyrical middle section until the drums take over once again. Conversational elements are pre present throughout. Please welcome the upper school percussionist.
Hello, my name is Ian Barnachia, and I'm in seventh grade. The next piece to be performed is Dill Pickles, a ragtime piece for xylophone and marimba accompaniment. This piece was first recorded in 1908. The xylophone was a popular instrument to record in the early 1900s because it was easy to record with its high frequency range. The, the solo will be performed by Anna Sims. Please welcome the sixth grade percussionists. Hi, my name is Susanna Kaiser and I'm in 11th grade. And I'm Laura Kaiser and I'm in 6th grade. Next on the program is Mozart's famous piece, Rondo a la Turc, which is from the third movement of Sonata No. 11 for piano. As you may or may not know, Mr. Beam has 20-month-old twin girls. One of their favorite shows to watch with their dad is Bluey, a cartoon with blue healers as the characters. 
In the very first episode, the dad pretends to play this piece as he tickles his girls. Mr. Bean would like to dedicate this piece to his girls, Lily and Abby. To, for, to perform this piece, please welcome the fifth grade percussionist. Hello, my name is Nicholas Fan, and I am a current senior. Uh, next on the concert is numerology. What began as a sketch in his composition class, the composer developed its thematic material into a full percussion ensemble. Numerology features a marimba soloist performed by Chris Serene with a percussion ensemble accompaniment. Please help me welcome the middle school percussionist. Thank you. 
Um, hi, my name is Keon Yusnasana, and I'm in eighth grade. This next piece is called Red Rock Canyon. It's from a suite of pieces entitled Three Scenes from the Desert. These pieces were inspired by the deserts of Southern Nevada and California. This particular movement was inspired by horse-drawn carriages, ranches, and frontier settlers. Please welcome our sixth grade percussionists.
Hello, my name is Travis Birdsell, a former John Cooper percussionist and a current freshman at the University of Florida. The ultimate piece on the concert tonight is Adagietto, the fourth movement of Gustav Mahler's Symphony No. 5. Mahler was a prolific composer in the late 1800s and 1900s, and he wrote this symphony in 1901 and 1902, just nine years before he passed. This particular movement, originally scored for strings and harp, a slow lyrical piece that has notably been used in such circumstances as Robert F. Kennedy's funeral mass con conducted by Leonard Bernstein, as well as commemorative events for September 11 attacks. Please welcome the upper school percussionist.
finally my turn to talk. Good evening, and thank you so much for being here. I can't tell you how proud of you, how proud of these kids I am. Please give them a hand. They've worked so hard to be prepared for you, and I, I think that's very apparent. Um, without their dedication and their hard work, this would not be possible. I truly am so grateful for what I get to do here at John Cooper, and thank you for letting me work with your incredible kids. One year ago when we did this concert, we had a few people on the screen, and I just couldn't properly um, think all the seniors. So I'd like Travis to come back up here, please. He didn't know I was doing this. Travis moved in freshman year, so he was here four years. And this concert is possible because of your hard work. You set a standard, you worked hard, you were a leader, and you have left a legacy on this, this campus uh, that wouldn't be possible. So thank you for your hard work and for leaving this, this legacy for these kids to follow. Thank you, and so glad you're here. Nick, come here, please. Let's talk about this year's seniors, or senior. When I first got here, I taught a master class as my audition to, to be hired. Nick was in fifth grade. And uh, over these years, I've seen you grow. I've seen you mature and become the face of this percussion section. Uh, thank you for your work, thank you for sticking it through, and thank you for always being prepared, always working hard, being dedicated. The list goes on and on. I'm so thankful for you. You'll definitely be missed. But I wanted to say thank you from the bottom of my heart to Nick Fan. Some more thank yous. Thank you to you guys for being here. Thank you for allowing your kids to be a percussionist. As you hear the snare drum and the practice pad and everything going on in your house and you're like, what have I done? This is what you've done, so thank you. Thank you for, to the John Cooper administration, always so supportive. Uh, thank you for the fine arts department. We have a great group here that's supportive of each other and I, I couldn't be luckier. To my beautiful wife, thank you for your love and support, I love you. And lastly, I'd like to thank Mr. Yarbrough and Ms. Kalisic. I couldn't ask for a more supportive and wonderful team to work for and work with. We truly have something special and I'm so thankful for your trust and your guidance and, and what we have built. Thank you so much. But enough for me. The last piece combines all 20 of our kids from fifth grade to 12th grade on one stage. This is a fun, Soul Calypso piece called El Cribe. Please welcome the percussionist.
Take another bow. Thank you again so much. Have a wonderful night.